Do this in the evening and you will find your money. Do this in the evening and you will find your money. Shalom, the Lord bless you. Welcome to Purpose and Marita Bliss with Pastor Honorine. I have a prophetic word for someone. And this word is coming to us from Ecclesiastes chapter 11 and verse 6. It says, sow your seed in the morning. And at evening, let your hands not be idle. For you do not know which, which will, will succeed. Whether this or that or whether both will do equally well. Hallelujah. And this is a word for someone who has been believing God for financial freedom. You've been believing God to get you out of debt. You've been believing God. You work double shifts. You work hard at your job. But yet, you are still just struggling. Let me start by presenting to you that your job is an acronym for just over broke. Just over broke. And the Bible is telling us that sow your seed in the morning and in the evening let your hands not be idle. In other words, when you go to your job in the morning, in the evening do something for yourself. In the evening solve a problem, be solving a problem for yourself. Do something for your own self. Use your gifts, your potentials, your abilities to get something for your own self. There is, that's where the money is. That's where your success is. Every, is, every, uh, in your world and your success are hidden in the problem you solve, not in your job. Your wealth and your success are hidden in the problem you solve. Don't go for money. Solve a problem and money will come for you. So it is not wise to put in your double shift in one job. No, go for the job. But after the job, what can you do with your hands? What are the gifts God has given you? What skill do you have? What can you do for yourself? You should work for your boss and work for yourself. That's how it starts. And before you know it, you are working for yourself. It's yielding so much that you have become a boss yourself because you need people to work under you this is a financial freedom word for someone i don't know who this word is for but god is saying so in the morning and do not let your hands be idle in the evening you don't know which of them will succeed and it could all could do well at the end of the day but if one is failing let not the other one at least one another one is going to rescue you don't have one source of income don't make up your mind not to have that hallelujah god bless you shalom